Hey guys, gonna do a two for one today. Um, so two videos in one day, R rare for me to do this, but I was messing around with this um, case for this 2011 Juan Pablo Montoya Cars 2. So this is how the case comes. Um, you know, with this clear case, it just kind of squeezes over the top here. Um, it's got this label on here. Obviously, I'm going to put uh, a, a, a label over top of that. Um, this is an M2, M2 case. Yeah, M2. So anyways, the way the car sits on this, right? So I, I, I run the wires around the axles, and then I bring them down through these posts. And you can see it's kind of raised up. And it and it's probably going to, I don't know, wiggle a little bit because it rests on top of there. Um, I was hoping to get this down to where it sits on the tires, not on the... Um, not on these posts. So how do I bring these posts down without like destroying the rest of this, right? I was thinking I could take a knife and kind of cut these uh, off and uh, and do that. But I was messing around with this thing and I got them down here like that. So that's kind of what I'm after right there. And I may have a little bit of a uh, a raised area with with the uh, with the wiring. I haven't wired them up yet. I got to put a couple more coats of clear sealer on this. But yeah, so that's kind of what I'm messing around with. And I just want to show you how I do it because it's actually kind of cool. Um, I'm <laughs> a little bit of history on me. I mean, I remember when I was a kid. You know, probably I don't know. Was I like between the ages of like eleven and thirteen? Me and my friends after school, we'd go out into the woods and just run around and start fires and stuff, uh, burning stuff, and we were kind of pyromaniacs. But uh, but I want to show you with this lighter how this works, right? Check this out. So this is just plastic, right? And it kind of melts it. Let's get this going again. And it starts its own little, little fire. So I kind of let that burn down. Probably going to set off the fire alarm in here. If I'm not too careful. But, you know, this plastic is now, I can just kind of peel it off while it's hot. drying on me. It's hardening on me. Okay. I, um, Then, right, I'll show you what I do when I get that, burn this other post down. I'm looking around where my fire smoke alarm is. It's on the other side of the basement, so I should have a, shouldn't have a problem. It's cool when it gets, uh, it gets burning by itself. Some serious smoke, huh? Okay. So the key is don't really need to get it off, just just off to the side to where I can pick it off once it hardens.
Obviously, I'm not overly concerned with the appearance of these posts. But I had some soot flying down. I'm not sure this is the best place to do that. I don't want it landing on my cars. But um, now that I've got that burned down, I'll show you what I did to kind of get this. Bring it over here. So then I just take my trusty drill, right? my little file here and this is where I got to be real careful because I was trying to file this down without you know I don't want to scrape this surface here so I gotta keep this really level and that's basically it well I shouldn't say that's it that's it for creating or getting the posts driven down right so they're nice and level now and then where's my it's not a perfect match but I took my silver then my silver paint pen let's it's all room temperature now. I just kind of go around the the edges of this. Again, you you know you're not going to see it unless you obviously take the car off the off the the base. But kind of covers that up. Obviously, you don't want to let the little post burn too much because it'll mess up the rest of the. the rest of the uh, display I can see this is a little indented I didn't notice that before but it's not that big of a deal you can see that what do you think I don't know I thought it was pretty fun <laughs> I, I'll, I'll tell you one time um, so so I have this um, I have this basket you can see my orange peels I had a couple oranges small oranges earlier but when I dip the cars in the solution and I scrape it off and there's a bunch of residue in there um, it just builds up over time and a few years ago I had my daughter down here she was young I mean this is we're probably talking like five years ago actually she was like nine or ten anyways I was messing around and I was showing her this and I had a car that didn't the, the paint didn't strip off very well so I I decided that I was gonna dip it in there and then I was gonna light it on fire <laughs> because that is super flammable that paint stripper is super flammable so I'm holding the car with my um, with my pliers right and I lit it and you know it just went up in flames and then it was dripping and it dripped into my box which had other residue in there and my whole box started on fire and I was like freaking out you know and she's laughing and I had to pick up the box and and run over to the um, uh, you know our basement door we have a door that goes outside and I basically threw the box outside 
uh, and just let it burn uh, so it would uh, obviously not burn our basement up and our house down. But that was uh, that was uh, one of my uh, uh, not one of my better moments. Let's put it that way. But I will tell you, my daughter thought that was the funniest thing. <laughs> <laughs> as I was messing around and trying to show her how I do stuff. So anyways, that's how I drive these posts down. And, um, and you know, I, I, I was saying I was, I could take like a little on my hacksaws and kind of cut it. Um, I could just take some pliers and cut it. I have these uh, that I've used before for various things that I could use to maybe clip them off. And maybe that's the probably the best way because I don't want to start a fire but is it the most fun way no burning things that can be kind of fun as you can see I'm enjoying it all right guys that's basically what I wanted to show you how I did that kind of a little fun video of me messing around being silly but um, uh, but yeah have fun with your hobby enjoy it obviously be safe um, I don't want uh, anybody to have any accidents but um uh but yeah it is uh it is kind of fun when you're when you're burning stuff and uh and taking care of um taking care of uh your custom die cast hobby as well trying to make it make it better i'm, I'm just kind of talking and taking this little sticker off but yeah so tell me what you think. Um, am I crazy or uh, just having fun? How would you guys take these little tops off? Um, put your comments down below. <clears throat> Always enjoy uh, reading the comments and people uh, asking questions and, and making comments on my videos. It's always fun. Um, I did finish this uh, Kyle Busch uh, Sport Clips car. And uh, I'm getting ready to take some pictures of that. Um, and posting that up on eBay. Uh, that's how I uh, arranged it. Um, brought the um, wires down here, uh, tied them around here very snugly. That's even a word. Um, and then uh, you know trimmed off the excess wire and folded them up here so that uh, so it'll sit flat. And yeah, so that'll be uh, that'll be a car. I think uh, I'm real happy with that with that car. That's uh, that's going to go well. Oop, I see a little mark on this side. I'll have to look at that. But, yeah. Thanks, guys, for watching. Uh, we will talk to you in the next video. Uh, hope, you, uh, hope you have a great night out here.